crisp, bright flavor shines like city lights on Lake Michigan. We constructed our urban pale ale on a balanced malt black stone. Oh, black bone. Backbone? <laughs> How many of these have I had? <laughs> Thinking to yourself today, what would Carl Winslow do? Hey guys, welcome to Foodie Girls. <laughs> it's 742 degrees in Los Angeles, and so we've resorted to eating everything outside. <laughs> She's nice. You ready for this? You ready for this? Well, we have a beautiful little cheese plate, and we have a couple of little beer flights courtesy of Goose Island Beer from Chicago, Illinois. 312. What what? That's delicious. That is really refreshing. <laughs> It's crisp. It's surprisingly refreshing. I mean, you can't go wrong with drinking cold beers when it's 5,000 degrees outside. Did it just go up to 5,000? Mm -hmm. I can't keep up with So, Chi, yeah. what is the best cheese to have for a beer night? I say go simple. Go a nice, solid American cheddar. It's sharp, it's tangy, it's going to be a nice, salty contrast to the beer. Also, put a blob of jelly on there. People really like that. <laughs> what is that, like a prison shank? Put some nuts on there, preferably some almonds. If not, walnuts do, or macadamias, or brazil nuts, or cashews, peanuts, or Ooh, peanuts. That shows no class. The fine folks over at Goose Island, where are you? Goose Island Beer Company. And the fine folks over at the Beer Island, <laughs> Beer Island, sign me up. <laughs> You're thinking beer and cheese, isn't it supposed to be wine and cheese? But this is just... This is just cooler. Look, not all of us can drink red wine like my mom and throw a couple ice cubes in there, okay? And be happy with it. I have the urban wheat ale. Are they both urban? Is that what they sent them to us? They're urban. They're urban and we're urban. I get it. If your beer had a name, what would her name be? This beer? Yeah. The skyscraper. Because it stands on its own. And it comes from Chicago. Mine would be called the Carl Winslow. Because it's big without being too bold and nice and funny and bright and that's the only other thing i know about chicago it's where the winslows lived carl winslow where are you, are you carl winslow hit us up what's carl winslow's real name reginald val johnson no way swear yeah i remember he was a cop for the chicago pd no i don't oh, remember carl that. winslow is he alive yeah oh, thank god. god i hope so oh. <laughs> thinking to yourself wow you know a collaboration i'd like to see Carl Winslow and the Foodie Girls. Should we not call him Carl Winslow anymore? I mean, I mean it in a term of endearment. Oh, we all do. I love Carl Winslow. In conclusion. Oh my god. Having Carl Winslow over for a night of beer and cheese <laughs> is the best goddamn thing you've got going. You ready for this? Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah.